Hello, everybody, and welcome to What Sold Saturday. What Sold Saturday. Finally, we are so, actually able to film a What Sold Saturday this week. Yes, in our apartment. We took a week off, but we are back, and we back. And we back. I had a pretty good week, so it was mediocre. I mean, like not complaining, but like not great. So this week covers the 27th of July through the 2nd of August. It's Happy already August, everybody. August. I know, I can't oh believe it's already August. That's when school starts God. and stuff, which for me, now that doesn't mean anything. I go anything. back to school in 23 days. I have 23 days left of a three month break. That doesn't seem possible. No, I can't believe it's already August. Oof. Um, but like, I love fall. So. And then before we know it, it's Christmas. That's I feel not, like that's, let's not think that far. I feel ahead, like that's usually how it goes. It's like it's August, school starts, it's Halloween, it's Christmas, which we are a very Halloween, Halloween heavy family. Halloween is my favorite day. I love it. My family's been obsessed with Halloween forever. Since. So excited, but also like not ready for another winter. So <sighs> like. Farmer's Almanac double said the winter wasn't supposed to be this bad. Double-edged sword. So like, I'm just ready for like sweaters and boots. Also, Mike is here and he has his bone. He, this he, was squeaky. He murdered the squeaker. He chewed it out and he gets mad. Oh, he's standing. He really doesn't like when things blow on him. So, like I said, the first day of this week we're covering is the 27th and I had two sales. I didn't have any. My first was this Free people, sheer purple print tunic, but this is also a mini dress. Not really sure what it's like intended to be, whatever. I feel like it just kind of depends this on This is height. one of my favorite free people pieces I've ever found. So you can cute. tell it's so cute. I just found it again this past weekend in like pink and light blue. This sold for $45 because it's really cute. It was intimately free people, but I priced it up because of how cute it was and it made me 36 and she said she loves it so much. So that's great. And my second sale on the 27th was this fossil black leather crossbody and this sold for 60 bucks and it gave me 48 and that was about five bucks I think from a Goodwill. So that was a good flip. Heck yeah. Leather fossil does Fossil's great. low key underrated. Fossil is extremely underrated. Like I feel like people don't really put enough value on it. No. Hmm. Okay. 28th, 28th, I had five. <gasps> okay, I had three. Good. Not great. Oh, a like very it. common theme of this week. Okay, my first one on the 28th were these fry. They were the lowest. Um, it was a Mary Jane style black leather heel. I found these in the bins. So like, blessed that a lot of this stuff came from the bins. Um, I got an offer of 40 and no mic is here. Mm -hmm. Hello, poor. Um, and I made 30, 20. Next, I really, 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 really didn't think this would sell for this much. Um, this was a sequined. H&M embellished boho festival vest is what I called it. I honestly thought this would end up going on the second closet and she added it to a bundle and just outright purchased it for 20 doll hairs. So, you know, 16 bucks and something from the bins isn't too bad. Okay, running with the theme of things from the bins, these Lululemon multicolored band run tracker short. Um, these, I got an offer of 40 and I got 32. So three items from the bins, I am not mad. Yeah, that's it? it for the 28th, yes. Okay, my first was this brand that I've tried now twice, and both times, the first time I tried it, it sold within 24 hours. The second time, this one, it sold within a week. It, was it is called Title Nine, and this one was the Delilah Duster in Teal wool cardigan, and it yes. sold for 23, which gave me 1840. I also new brand for me, but I Hello. if you couldn't tell if you have not watched the haul, I mean one of them. I, who knows at this point? We've done so many hauls recently. It was in yeah. one of them within the past month. <laughs> this T Tahari wool blend belted cardigan coat. Oh my gosh! I was so obsessed pretty. with this coat. And I knew it would do good. I got it from the bins. It sold for sixty dollars, and that gave me forty-eight. It's and coat I got season, five stars. Yeah. I sold this Bagley Mishka Kiara Jewel Platform Pump. 
which I've had for like ever at this point. And it's that's a very, very old trip to the designer discount store. Yes. And then sold for difference. 70 and gave me 56. I also sold these Tom's leather sandstorm sandals. As we said, Tom's, if they're not the like Tom's shoes, like the ones you think the, of with like, the canvas. Kind of ones, yeah. If it's anything besides that, they do good. If it's like the suede boots, mm -hmm. the sandals, or the, the like sneakers, sneakers, the sneakers, they do good. Really, really, really good too. So pick those up, but not the canvas ones. Got five stars. She paid 34, gave me 25.40. I sold this Lululemon in the Flow Crop 2 in Henley Gray for $70. This was from the bins and it gave me That's 56. Insane. These are those ones when you hold Crazy. them up. Crazy. The legs just go like whoop. They look really weird. In the flow, on Lululemon somebody. are the ones that like they look really go weird. out because there's like they're rouged. I call it scrunched. Oh, well scrunched. Like rouged. a scrunchy. They're funky looking in there. And so that was it for the 28th. Okay, 29th, I only had one. I had two. Okay. Uh, one and only for me on the 29th. New brand, so like, okay. Uh, these Bonobos men's, they were a salmon a straight leg travel jeans. I got an offer of 21 for these and I made $15. I feel like I might pick them up again if I see them at the bins. That's I don't, fast. Yeah, I don't think I'd pick them up at a Goodwill maybe. Okay, so the first of my two was this Fossil Teal Snap Bifold Wallet. Sold for 25, give me 20, but like, I paid like three or four. It was a quick flip for 25. Oops, Worth it. Um, and my second one was this Tory Burch oh, Black this Leather Crossbody. Money. <laughs> oh my gosh. So I paid like between six and eight dollars for this i think it was six she paid a hundred and forty eight dollars for this crossbody it had creases it had like a bit of like a little bit of wear it was pretty good condition but it had a little bit of wear Looked not perfect wear. but like it was pretty good oh, 148 bucks that gave me 118.40 tory birch always Always get it. Okay, 30th, I had three. I had three also. Okay, I'll let you go first this time. First, I sold this Adidas NMD R1 sneaker. Um, this is from the bins, it was a little dirty. Everyone kind of skipped it because it was a little dirty, but like a toothbrush with some dish soap. We got a magic eraser and some dish soap here. Yeah, Who cares? Like, it's fine. Um, I listed it for 56, because like this is a new it's style cool. and it's Adidas Originals. But it sold for 30 because he sent me an offer. He or she sent me an offer and I took it because it was from the bins and they were light and so I made 24. J. Crew linen stuff. jogger pants, again from the bins. They were a double zero. They were. I had them listed teeny, for 34. Tiny. She offered 18. They are, again, I repeat, a double zero. I would never even think, I don't even, like, they're from the bins, that's the only reason I got them. I, I would never like imagine selling a double zero. So tiny. So the fact that she offered anything, took it, fourteen forty for me, I'll take it. You know, that's thirteen forty going into my pocket. After being. And the Lululemon split side gray tank sold for 30 and gave me 24 another bins fine, probably cost me, like, literally 50 Mike, cents. tickling me. Mike's licking my feet. Sorry. Mike likes the big feet. He likes feet. It's his way of showing his appreciation. Okay. First on the 30th, I've said it before and I'll say it again. Pick up Chaco sandals. Um, I sold these Chaco Orange ZX2 Classic Zito Loop Strap Sandal, size 7. Um, she bought these outright for 60 so I made $48. When, coincidentally, some lady the night before she this other lady purchased these, offered me 25 and said, quote, they are in very used condition. Okay. I do not get the concept of you want to buy something and so you insult, you insult the it item. to make it like... No. Like, I, my rationale is like, the, the buyer, the potential buyer, is trying to make me kind of like, 
see it Think in their worse. light. And so, as a seller, I'm like, if you insult my item, I'm less get likely blocked. to That's take That's exactly what offer. happened. She's on my block list now. And this lovely lady is walking away with a pair of $40, $60 chocos. Next were these, oh, those are from the bins. So continuing with my theme of the week. Next were these new tag Torrid Camo Skinny Pants. Two themes, bins, A. B, Torrid doesn't sell for a whole lot of money. I got these in the bins because they were new tag and plus size always does pretty well for me. Um, I listed these kind of high at 38 and I got an offer at 20 and I said, keep them, I don't need them. Taking up room in my house. Last but not least in the 30th, again, bins, these Corky's leather zip up booties. Um, I got an offer at 35 for these. I have it to accept it, it's only $20. 31st, I had two. I didn't have any. I had none. So my first one to all our people that watch that oh like, Lord. that support and love Tabby. I It's five years old, you dumbass. Really soft and nice. It's That's a really new tag cabby. Which like, I know everyone like it's mad when people say new tag cabby, not sure why, but They do? Yes. Apparently like it's five years old. Don't say that, you dumbass. <laughs> Sorry, every time anybody says cabby in this household, that's like my mental link. I've been it's researching so the cabbies I find now. And anyone that looks like they sell for a lot, I try to pick up. And I picked up this cabby style number 3366 zip gray ribbed como cardigan. It's sold for 45, know. which I've never ever sold a cabbie for that much. Absolutely and it made wine. me 3420 and I think I found it in the bins. It was really nice. It was really and it was cute. new tag. My second sale was this Anthropology Elevenses Wool Blend Peplum Coat, and I had the fur trim that goes with it, the fur collar. 55 gave me 44. It was so nice. Like, the wool was, really, was really, really well made. so it was really cute. Nice. Especially for like an older anthro piece. Oh. Yeah. And like, and like, the fact that we had the fur collar. We could tell by the model picture this was like quite a bit. Older. It was one of the anthro pictures that's but, on the like paper, but, like bodice mannequin. But it, it was nice. It was really cool. So it I get really it. Cute. It was cute. Okay. How many um, did you have first, in the first? I had three. I had one. You can go. Okay. My one and only for the first were these Urban Outfitters BDG mom jeans in the style Rebel. Rebel, I do not like awesome, but like pretty decent with like thrashed as the bin prickers would call them, uh, denim. And these were uh, thrashed. If you remember from the closet tour, I have those Brandy Melville jeans that look like I was attacked by a bear. This was the same thing, only in lighter wash. I found these for him. <laughs> and he gave them to me because he knows I like <sighs> to sell them. Um, I got an offer at 20 and I just took it. Urban doesn't always do it's, They were BDG, the Urban Outfitters, kind of like main denim brand. Um, you know, I'll take 20 bucks from the bins. I'm not mad. I made 16. So my first on the first was this Vineyard Vines blue logo hat. This is from the bins. It was a woman's and it did have makeup stains around the like bill side. The inside. Of the hat. And she paid 13 and gave me 825 because I gave her a shipping discount. This pair of Under Armour logo shorts. Like I said, this is becoming my bread and butter pretty quick. And I good. sell them consistently for 15 which obviously is not like a ton, but when I pay literally like 50 cents at the bins, I will take and it. And they're lightweight too. They're not a heavy That's, brand. Yeah, like, like 50 sure. cents. And so I made 12. I've now sold three pair in the past month, I'd say, for 15 each. So like, it's probably I past love it. A couple weeks at least. And yeah, then I, last but oh, not least, on the this. first, sold uh -huh. this Bowden Heritage Pattern Duster Cardigan. Like I always say, if you take good pictures, you can get, you can get good money. money for things uh, that other people could not. Yep. If you do not have lights studio lights to take pictures with please get them i They're promise so you they shady. are not that expensive on yeah, amazon thirty dollars for each of them on amazon get one or it even looks so much better if you have two but at mm -hmm. least get one they pay off they will make you more money this picture of this bowden heritage pattern duster cardigan is under two studio lights wonderful 
and I did not use the model picture. I had one, but I didn't use it because of how good this looked. And I got $60 for a Bowdoin sweater. That's a lot. And the description said, still pilly. Get lights. <laughs> like, I cannot preach that enough. Mm -hmm. They sold for 60 like I said, and I made 48 So, again, good pictures can get earn you more money. Like, it is they're amazing they're very well worth and worth like, the investment the lights that we have we've had these for over a year we haven't had to replace any bulbs we haven't had to replace any parts we haven't had to like you know fix anything they've been like you don't need like perfect. top of the line lights no we literally we got the, like, i bought the cheapest one on amazon <laughs> i, I filtered find. i went i remember vividly looking up like photography lighting going from price low to high prime that's it and ours were 30 to 35 a piece. That's two sales. You know, you sell two things that are $30. There's 24. There's 48. Pays for almost both of them. Easy. Like super said, nice. Like, they're super, 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 super good investment. <laughs> so this is the second. Mm -hmm. I had five. I had six. First on the second, I made a very prevalent mental note to not forget this. I had a Mercari sale. Thank God. Um, I sold one of my old personal backpacks because I feel like I'm going to get a lot of bags recently. Um, it was the Fossil Black Leather, the Vickery backpack is what it was called. I listed this kind of high because it was mine and I had some sentimental attachment to it. But like for the right price, no problem. Um, she offered me 55 and I said, at my house. So I got $49. Next uh, were these Fabletics High Waisted Solid Power Hold Leggings. Um, these were just kind of like a plain tealy blue color. She offered me 30 and I said, okay. Next was this New Tag Dooney and Burke Leather Lock Shopper that I purchased from Poshmark. Somebody listed it way too low and I said, I'll make more money on that. Thank you. And I did. Um, listed it for 150 I got an offer of 100 and I made $80. Next was this Athleta Sweet Sport Skort Black Golf Skirt. Sweet Sport Skort Black Golf Skirt. Okay. She offered me 28 and I got 2060. Next was another pair of Athleta. This one is not a tongue twister. The Black High Rise Moto Drifter Leggings. I got an offer of 20. I got 16. And that's all she wrote. So on the second, my first sale was this New Without Tag Zara Central Stripe black dress um this was the new zara tag i only know because i go into the store sometimes <laughs> we venture into the nightmare that <laughs> and it, it had the store. like loop that the tag was on still attached not the tag so i knew it was new without tag and i kind of regretted it right away because like look it's kind of boring but since it's newer it actually sold pretty decently fast for 40 bucks and gave me 32 definitely didn't expect that but very Some happy. kind of basic Zara, it just kind of hit or miss. It just kind of depends. I also saw this new J. Crew low ride bikini puckered blue stripe. <laughs> Some of my titles, it's, it's I just throw shoot. in all the words. Um, <laughs> we have so I got this from the J. Crew clearance last year. I would advise you not to do that. Bad idea. I probably paid. 10 for the tops, 10 for the bottoms. I sold them together for 15. So. You know, we call that in this house. Live and learn. learn. A learning opportunity. <laughs> you don't always make money on everything. That's so okay. I made 12. I also sold this, as you know, from the last haul. Vera Bradley green and pink floral school backpack. These Vera back I am obsessed are crazy. with finding these Vera school backpacks, especially <laughs> around school starting. It sold for 35 and gave me 28 as you guys know, because you hopefully and probably have watched the haul. It sold within a week. So 20, like turning a buck 50 to 28 in a week. I'll I'm not it. mad at that. Oh my God. Pay for two of my meals. Um, I also sold this new tag, Free People Who's Sorry Now Slip Dress, and this I just relisted today, and it sold today as the new listing for 40 Proof bucks and gave me 32. Works. So yeah, sometimes you, you should money. relist 
Um, I also saw this Ted Baker patterned snap wallet. I'm sorry, mom, because it had a French bulldog pattern inside, which she's obsessed with. Sorry, Debbie. You but I got already. it at the bins. Probably cost me literally about a dollar. I sold it for 40, gave me 32. And my last one for the second was this J. Crew ribbed eyelet sleeve sweater white. Another re list. I, had, I need to read Today, this it, she, he or she paid 24 and it gave me 1920. So, Anywho, now we you. move on to our gross and our net. You look like an Animal Crossing character. Okay. So my gross, or your gross, who should we do? Let's do me. She didn't, yeah, I don't... <laughs> The money I made before fees and things was four eighty nine. Oh, gross! <laughs> yeah, exactly. Okay. My gross was nine hundred and thirty five. <laughs> and my net. I'm gonna kill myself. My net was three ninety six seventy. Three ninety six dollars seventy cents. Was seven hundred and forty two twenty five. So I had a pretty good week. I feel like I don't know why, but I feel like I have a good week and then a not so good week and then a good week and then a not so good week. That's I how feel mine like this week because I think last time we did a what sold Saturday, I was in a really good week and I made like six so something. Seven. That so, is it for our what sold Saturday for the twenty seventh through the second. He's back and. <laughs> I would not expect one next weekend. No. I'm sorry to say that. Sorry, everybody. I Unless it's just me. Tuesday, expect a we collaboration. Have a collaboration video. We've never done a collaboration before with another, like, posh tuber. Posh but tuber. That's what we're doing. We have a collaboration with someone, and you'll see what it is and who it is on Tuesday. And Thursday... We haven't decided yet, <laughs> so stay tuned. But we will have something, we'll something out coming Thursday. out mm. Tuesday. We for sure, and Thursday we just don't know what it is, but we'll we will we have something coming sometime this week. Be sure to subscribe <laughs> and turn on notifications so you don't miss our collaboration and our Thursday video. Thank you for watching this thank week's What's you. On thank Saturday. You, I hope you, you enjoyed you, it. You, and you. let us know how your week went. Yeah, was it an okay week? So far, like was I said, it a really good week? July was shockingly such a good week. I'm on... Which, or, July was a good week. July, <laughs> shockingly, was such a it good was a month really good for me. Month. I'm not I don't mad know at how it. it was so good because it's supposed to be one of the two main like summer slowdown months, but I'm like I'm not upset. And it's funny now that we've officially like moved into August. I think everybody's in the back to school mindset. It's the last and month. I've already be sure to pay last... your taxes. It's the last month of quarter three. Is it so three or is it? It's quarter October. three. Yeah, because October is already so. Hmm. Hopefully we can finish quarter three strong. <laughs> we can do this. Okay, okay, thank you for watching. We're gonna leave, finally. Sorry happy for taking so long. Back to school. If you're a parent, if be not, sure to pick happy up backpacks beginning of August. and sweaters. Backpack sweaters, jeans. Bye. Guten Tag. No, that's hello. Off Peterson, as Heidi Klum says. Auf Peterson. Auf Peterson. Auf Peterson.